Good morning. Welcome to the Scrap and Pallet Man channel. Yeah, I got something to ship. This is a good box. That's right. Get in my truck. Gonna fit. almost an empty truck yeah I'm more like the scrapping one-armed man because my left arm is a little messed up yeah they don't recycle scrap aluminum just cans kind of says what it goes in here Awesome. It's my blue truck nemesis guy. That's right. What's he looking for? Hmm. Saw him driving around. You know, he's got his gloves. He's grabbing something. A tundra. All right. Wait a minute. That was Grumpy G Man. He waved at me. Whoo! No, it's all garbage TVs, or uh, just the plastic. Uh, but no, that was a. Uh, man, today's a good day. Grumpy G Man gave me a wave. Woot! to this truck yet. <clears throat> I saw some Romex sticking out. Let's see. Let's see if I'm right. Oh, it's been... <laughs> Someone's been stripping their wire. That's all. <laughs> That's awesome, dude. Seriously. Stripping y'all's wire. Yep, you can tell scrap prices are going up. But I will take a little steel. Yes, sir. Yeah, man. So some of y'all might notice something different. Yeah, it doesn't look like it, but it's a nine year old truck. Oh, the little tick, 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 tick sound. Yeah, got a killer deal on it. Oh my goodness. I'm so happy. Eight foot bed, extended cab, has a back seat. Mm, God is good. You're good. Thank you for helping me with this. Oh, y'alls. Seriously, thank you. So there's supposed to be a huge snowstorm um, starting in a few hours and lasting 24 hours yeah this is so nice not having the, the clutch all the time um, yeah um, even though it does it's so stupid it I shouldn't say stupid it's ridiculous that it actually hurts my left shoulder with the blinkers my turn signal there's certain things I can do with my left arm. There's certain things I can't. It's just, I don't know. There's so many muscles, but it's my supraspinatus muscle that goes on top of my humerus, my not so funny, funny bone. Something caught my eye over here. No, <laughs> it's a Cubs. Wow, there's a lot of kids stuff here. <laughs> Merry Christmas. 
All right, we'll do a little kid donating. Sure, why not? No, I'm, are they taking stuff like this? Ah, an old telephone. No way. All right, you're coming with me. Okay. You're coming with me. What else we have here? I don't know if they're taking tactile toys. You know, toys you, you touch because of viruses. Viri? Is that, is that? I don't know. Hmm. Do I need something like that? Could I use something like that? Home of the... <laughs> That's funny. Hmm. Containers. Huh. I'll just donate these toys. Hmm. Let's do it on the side. Ooh, that one's cold. Just in case anyone's wondering, I still have my blue truck. Yes, I did not trade it in or anything. Um, and I was able to save up enough money where I don't have any payments or anything. So uh, thank God for that. And thank you, seriously. Because if I could like, you know, divide up this truck between like YouTube money and PayPal tip jar and then like for, for this part right here would be uh, merchandise, you know, the hoodies and coffee mugs. Um, and then like scrap money would be back here. And yeah. uh, I'm so grateful for this. I'm beside myself. That's, that's, I am. So yeah, so I still have um, the blue truck, which I'm still gonna use. So you, you'll see videos of me running around in that. Um, yeah, especially like right now, it's um, really low scrap out here because scrap prices are so high right now. Everybody and their brother and mother and aunt and uncle are scrappers um, <laughs> dragging stuff to the scrapyard. Um, so yeah, there's not a lot out here. There isn't. Bruh. Look at that ladder rack with ladders. Man. That's a sweet ladder rack, I'm telling you. <laughs> Riders on the storm. <laughs> I got that song stuck in my head. Just because there's a storm coming, as there's a snowstorm coming. Yeah. Can you feel that bass from having the one window down? Did it go away? Yeah. <laughs> it's like so when you have like one window down, or especially a back window, it's like. Whoa, 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 whoa. Yeah. Look, it's a little truck. Yeah, it's I'm gonna it's gonna take some getting used to this um the truck, that's for sure. Yeah, I uh <laughs> I've already had one close call. Because the the size of here, let me straighten up. The size of this little thing between the windshield and this door, it's kind of bigger. And so like when I look real quick to the right, um last I just driving into this subdivision. Um, I didn't do a second glance and I started to go right as a car came out of my blind spot with this bar. Um, yeah, mm, not good. I shouldn't say close call. It was, um, it alarmed me. I don't think the other driver even noticed. Yeah, because I just kind of went up. I'm like, oh, hey, wait, there's a car coming. Do I see a bunch of towels? Yep. Seems as I'm going to donate. Might as well donate those. 
know what I mean, Vern? They're beach towels. Yeah. Is that a, is that a mini mouse towel? It is. That is. is that a towel too? Yeah. That's a moo towel. That's a towel from a <laughs> from a resort pool area because it has that orange stripe. Y'all been taking your resort towels home, haven't you? Right. WD-40 on that hinge, that door hinge. All right, I need to find some uh, styrofoam for some packing. But you know what's really cool? See the Salvation truck, Salvation Army truck? Um, I'm trying not to hit this guy. Uh, it's for the, their food pantry. Hey, there is a lot more of that. Uh, and I'm so grateful that the grocery stores here um, including Aldi, which is notorious for throwing away food and stuff. Um, they are donating their stuff that is out a little bit outside of their ripe or really close to expiration. Um, so it is going, it's getting into bellies instead of getting into dumpsters and into our landfill. So I'm, I am happy about that, but it's also happening because of a need. There is a, um, I get it. There's, there's, yeah, this is, um, we're a year into this uh, pandemic um, and e mind-blowing economic change in people's lives. Um, yeah, let's look here for some, for some Christmas trees now. Uh, so I, I'm grateful that there's uh, that Companies are being mindful about what they're doing with their waste. So, I'm wondering, should I use cardboard as packing material? Maybe. Yeah, definitely. So I can do little stuff like that, like opening doors with my um, left arm, but it's it's going that direction, you know, lifting sideways type stuff. Yeah, I can't do that. <sighs> yeah, the uh, skip pirates, I think they call, or skid pirates. Yeah, any of their odd size pallets, they like put them over here. And I've discovered recently, and I, I see the guy pulling back here and dropping them off because he's trying to get just the pallets that are 48 by 40 four way pallets. So when he gets odd size ones, he, he packs them over here. Um, I don't know if he has permission or not, but he does come back and gets them in one load. Yeah, like that, that's a. No, that's, that's an outsized pallet. But yeah, he, he does come back and get them. I think people come over here and for different pallet projects. Yeah. Dollar store. I'm looking for styrofoam. That's what I want. Not donuts. Wow. That's some different kind of dumping. Hmm. Yeah, that's, uh, I smell soaps. Yeah, I want styrofoam. Come on, styrofoam. Nope. <clears throat> you see that bulldog in the truck? That's awesome. <laughs> Seriously, beyond cool. Yeah, that's me circling around behind all the dumpsters at these, um, strip mall places yeah i didn't find any 
styrofoam. So I got an idea. Maybe I'm going to wrap that item up in a <laughs> towel I just found. Is that wrong? But I'm thinking it's it's that old uh, sewing machine. If I wrap it up in the, so if I wrap it up in a towel, it's not going to have those little pieces poking out because it'll poke right through a cardboard. I know it will. Even if I put a even if I box it up and then put that box in a box, I th think it's going to uh, pop right through the cardboard. So I think I'm going to wrap it in a towel, put it in a box, then put that. Um, yeah, two hands on the wheel, Paul. Okay. Uh, put that box in a box. Okay. You got it. Go. You are getting shipped, Missy. <laughs> so yeah, I think I'm gonna use. Oh, it's it's for a kid. It's a little hoodie for a little bathroom thing. Ah, love Minnie. That's adorable. Okay, it's not gonna fit in that box, is it? I'm not that good at this. I mean, I think I can do it. Hmm. All right. Hmm. You know, let's test it by putting the box on it. How's that? Without the ice. something around it huh is this one of those little hoodie things too nope that's a towel it's a I can't read towel I have no idea what that says R A P U N Z E L Rapunzel yeah I had to spell it before I could actually know what the word was that's funny. Hmm. All right, Rapunzel. use a couple more pieces a couple more towels which I got a few more over here Ugh. um no, that's too dirty <laughs> these aren't towels it's packing material I think these are, uh, because it's not like real terry cloth. I mean, it, it is to a small degree, but it's more of a print. Yeah. This is gonna actually work out. Cool. Yeah, I don't think it's gonna get destroyed by doing this. I 
I have to remember to put the foot switch in there too. This is not light. Yeah. Now, is it actually gonna fit a regular box? This is kind of extra beefy. Or do I need more? Hmm, that looks like a little smaller. Hmm, this might be the right size box. Yeah. <laughs> okay, so after a bunch of wrestling around here, I don't know, should I put some something in there? basically gonna be a box in a box yeah all right so I'm gonna end the video right now I just want to thank you for hanging out with me and uh, going on today's journey even though I was two hours of trash picking and I found some aluminum and some towels <laughs> a couple teddy bears I think and that was it so uh, yeah thanks and thanks God for this day thank you for this time lord let us oh, let's just be reminded that we have physical limitations like my shoulder mm. still want to praise you completely god ah, thank you amen